things are and uh, you want to be re I'm Cabot Finch public relations and crisis management and I'm here to help you you'll start by building a Hammond creation lab we've already started on an enclosure for you you should just attach it to the side but watch out for dinosaurs <laughs> just kidding <laughs> Let's focus on what you're here to do, which is create dinosaur facilities on the islands we call the Five Deaths. Actually, Las Cinco Muertes, <laughs> because Spanish is the lingo of choice around here. You'll need to connect it to the pre-existing network of paths and the power grid. Now comes the real test, incubating a dinosaur. You'll start with a Struthiomimus. Select the creation lab and pick a hatchery bay. There's enough genome data for your first viable dinosaur. The machinations of the ambitious, undoing extinction, playing with nature's laws. What can possibly go wrong? Come on, doctor. You know we've learned so much and invested even more in our Jurassic operations since the last time. Yes, Mr. Finch, yes, the, the last time. There's always a last time, and a next. Foundation has three main areas of interest. Security, entertainment, and science. I've already nudged the heads of each division to reach out to you personally. They'll offer opportunities and incentives for you to be part of their team. Choose one of their contracts. It'll help you develop your facility. Ah, Dr. Dua. This is our new Director of Operations. I'm aware, Cabot. I'm Dr. Dewar. I run the science division of our operation. Okay, you're going to need to build your reputation in the science division. Not easy with me around, but you'll manage. That means managing our dinosaur population and seeing that they are flourishing. Contracts can be requested from the division heads inside the control room. Complete these to increase your reputation and gain additional revenue to keep expanding your park.
People think money makes the world go around, but they're wrong. Contracts make the world go around, my friend. Obligations and commitments. Complete a contract and your rep with the science division will increase. Meaning you'll be able to take on more complex and challenging missions. An expedition center will allow you to send dig teams around the world in search of new dino fossils. DNA can be extracted from these fossils, which our scientists can then turn into living, breathing dinosaurs. And that's our true lifeblood. I've got an interesting opportunity for you to consider. It will allow us to work together to create life pure life. If you've been listening to Dr. Malcolm, then you know how important this is to us, and to me. I knew you were my kind of person. Inquisitive, driven, and I knew you couldn't resist this opportunity. So let's get started. Together, we can create a more authentic version of our dinosaurs. That means a complete genome. And I think you are up to the challenge. Don't disappoint. Good! Your first expedition team is out. They'll bring back what they find to the fossil center for extraction. The job is simple, really. Create dinosaurs which attract visitors to your facilities, brings in capital, money, huh? Which means you can do more research to build better facilities and create more dinosaurs, and there you go. A circle of life, development and resources, nature and commerce. See? Simple. <laughs> Ruthiomimus. Interesting. Another dinosaur that furthers the case of a direct linkage to our modern birds. I'm Owen Grady, Owen to my friends. I've seen things I'd rather not talk about, but it hasn't dampened my commitment to the dinosaurs. The raptors more generally, and me and Blue specifically. We have a special relationship, like what I have with Claire. Less complicated. Anyway, nice to meet you. Power is something we simply cannot ignore when it comes to our operations. Without power, we, uh, well, we, we don't have any power. You should extract genomes from fossils that have been collected inside your fossil center. That will increase the amount of viable data you have to create dinosaurs.
The research center lets you improve your park in various exciting ways. New buildings, upgrades, and more await. making great strides so far. I believe I may be on the cusp of something wondrous, and I have you to thank, at least in part, for where I find myself. Now we need to incubate, hatch, and house our dinosaur. Then we will know if our efforts will have been worth it. One of your dinosaurs has failed to incubate. I never said bringing back dinosaurs was gonna be easy. That's your next assignment. Making sure our specimens are properly cared for. In other words, dinosaur welfare. The difference with dinosaurs is that they have no point of reference to understand humans, so don't expect much in the way of thank yous. This is Lambert, head of security. Yours, theirs, and mine. Welcome to the islands. So here's our basic conundrum. We want to keep our animals under control while simultaneously encouraging instinctive behaviors because these animals have potential as combatants. Look, everyone's fear object, myself included, is to have these animals running free and loose in the park. But we can't exploit them globally without taking some chances. I've been monitoring what you've been up to with great interest, and I'm a little disappointed that Dr. Dua came to you for this assignment instead of bringing me into the loop as she should have done. I'll discuss this with her later. 
I'm Claire Deering, and I've been on these islands before. On Isla Nublar, I made some mistakes, and I've tried to set them right. I believe in what we're doing, and I believe in these dinosaurs. We need more people like you on the team. I'm closing that acquired genome contract and giving you the credit. Remember this when I need something from you in the future. Like us, different dinosaurs require different diets. Make sure to place the correct type of feeder in an enclosure. I'm a red meat man myself. <laughs> Edmontosaurus was originally uncovered at a site in Canada. I'll let you guess where. The T-Rex thinks these are delicious, and who's to argue?
It's a dangerous world, and this place makes it more dangerous. This contract can help us with security here.
I feel like something's missing. Добро пожаловать в юридического периода. Желаем вам приятного и безопасного отдыха.
gosh, you got a sick dinosaur on your hands. It's time to treat it. Or what comes next, that's going to be on your hands as well. to a pure strain dinosaur. This will definitely shift the paradigm. I can't ignore this accomplishment. Oh, with your help, obviously. That goes without saying. But under my direction. I think we make a good team. Let's do this again. I'll let you know when. I've witnessed Dr. Dua flail and fail before. Now with you, she believes she is on her way. Does she really think she can accomplish what I have not? The science division thanks you, and so do I. No matter what anyone else says, science is what makes or breaks us. Admittedly, sometimes both. But on Isla Matanceros, 
You are making us and yourself look good. And that's worth a reward. I don't know what's next for the little critters, but they are no longer our problem. Which means that contract is complete. Nice job. Lambert here. I've got a new assignment that I think is perfect for your skill set. Give it a once over, then let me know if you're interested. Glad to have you on board. As you can imagine, the animals in the various facilities are constantly probing for weaknesses in our security systems. They're smarter and more devious than people give them credit for. But I refuse to underestimate their capabilities. That's why I'm always testing and evaluating our security protocols and barriers. And this is where you come in. I've got to give this guy Lambert his due. He actually sees these animals as both opportunity and threat. I'm gonna need you to extract enough DNA from fossils to incubate and hatch a dinosaur. This is the first phase of this mission. Carry on. Okay, next you'll need to incubate the animal in a Hammond Creation Laboratory before releasing and housing it in an enclosure. You'll also want to make sure we've got an ACU presence on this island. I see you've hatched a Triceratops. It might be cute now, but that's only gonna last for about a week.
this next bit is gonna sound a little crazy because frankly, it is. But we are gonna encourage one of the dinosaurs to breach our containment grid. We'll then react and see if our procedures and personnel are up to the challenge. Yes. So at this point, I'd like to take back everything I just said about this guy. dinosaur. You'll need to call in the offshore transport team to safely move this dinosaur back to its enclosure. is too small for them. Hey, I'm Isaac. I've been hearing good things about you. I'm in charge of the entertainment division here. What good is the world's greatest show if no one sees it? Don't answer. That's rhetorical and painfully obvious. What I'm saying is that we need people in our parks. Fill up our facilities with warm bodies. Numbers bring revenue, excitement, and opportunities. Acknowledging request for repair crew. Okay, we have our runner. Time to tag him and bag him. We're using less than lethal, but remember, that dinosaur doesn't know this is just supposed to be a drill. So watch your back. While I understand the need to keep our security as sharp as possible, this is not the way I would go about doing it. You have a problem with how we keep you safe, Doctor. I'm happy to discuss it at a later time. Right now, we have our hands full. Acknowledging asset collection request. Asset collection. 
confirmation request received. Finished. True and square. Look, the thing is, we're still learning where our boundaries are when it comes to keeping these animals under control. God knows they're working out ways to exploit our weaknesses. Guess we'll find out who gets to the limits of our abilities first. Us, or them. Ever vigilant. And that's always been the challenge of the Jurassic Industrial Complex. Exploitation versus security. The immense potential for profit and for violence. I can't thank you enough, which means I'm not gonna try. Protect your park's structure against storm damage. Useful, huh? 